Now, the condition. This king of Naples, being an enemy to me inveterate, hearkens my brother's suit, which was that he, in lieu of the premises of homage and I know not how much tribute, should presently extirpate me and mine out of the dukedom and confer fair Milan with all the honours on my brother. Whereon a treacherous army levied one midnight did Antonio open the gates of Milan, and in the dead of darkness, the ministers for the purpose hurried thence me and thy crying self. I'll show thee the best springs, I'll pluck thee berries, I'll fish for thee, I'll bring thee wood enough, a plague upon the tyrant that I serve. I'll bear him no more sticks, but follow thee, thou wondrous man. If by your art, my dearest father, you have put the wild waters in this roar a lay them, the sky, it seems, would pour down stinking pitch, but that the sea, mounting to the welkin's cheek, dashes the fire out. Oh, I have suffered with those that I saw suffer. I boarded the king's ship, now in the beak, now in the waist, the deck, in every cabin. I flamed amazement, the fire and cracks of the sulphurous roaring, the most mighty Neptune seemed to besiege and make his bold waves tremble, yea, his dread trident shake. 